Hello, this is Leonardo, and in this video I'm going to show you the new oscillator, uh, which is called Bleak. And this is in fact, uh, it's part, it's exactly this oscillator that is found, found in Incubus, which is a, a simplified version of one of the oscillators in VESEC. So, I mean, what I did was... Uh, the oscillator in basic has, has more features, and I needed a, a, a simpler version for it, so that's why I took some old code that I have, and that's what I implemented in, in Incubus. And now I'm, I'm splitting it from Incubus and, and providing it as, as a complete separate oscillator with uh, the same if, uh, form factor as a uh, basal and and also like very simple controls to use it to modulators tuning and an octave control so let's listen to it this is the the square waveform you have the tune control one octave up one down and this is the octave control let me lower a little bit the volume and the implementation of this one is, is completely alias free. So if we go to the, one of his maximum frequencies, we can see that there is no, no alias at all. I'm gonna keep it like that. And yeah, if, if I enable the pulse width modulation, we can see how, how the, the harmonics are affected, but no alias is introduced. The same with the wave, we can see that only the harmonics change, but there is no aliasing. Okay, now I'm going to... I'm going to show you again, but with a waveform which that is easier to, to see. So you have the pulse width control. You have the wave control, which in the middle, it's, it's, a, it's a pulse, it's a square wave. Uh, and then we have the triangle, and it has the same behavior as in VESEC. It's not a perfect triangle uh, in the lower frequencies, but as you go, as you go higher, it's, it has a more like a triangle shape. And this, this implementation, I actually like it this way because it has more harmonics in the, when, it's, when it's a lower frequency, so it doesn't sound that dull and on this side we have the the saw wave and we have uh, the same we can control something similar to to the pulse width the same with the triangle and of course the interesting thing about this oscillator is that we can uh, we have one control that we can modulate And this is it. This is this is bleak. And as I mentioned, I, I did it with the intention of being like a very good sounding oscillator and easy to use, and also quite quite low in the in the CPU consumption. And it, it's going to be available in the free package as well. And the, it should be available very soon. Maybe it's not if you watch this video. Uh, this day, uh, the day that I'm releasing the video, but it's gonna be available in the in a few days. So that's it. Thank you very much. Goodbye.